Na proglasu začal pořad Jak se vám líbí, vítá vás Milan Tesař. Dnes je mým hostem skotský písničkář Steven Johnston, kterého tady vítám. Hi, Steven. Steven má projekt Damask Rose, pod tímto jménem natočil první album s brněnskou kapelou, kterou dal dohromady kytarista Pavel Šmít v Rustical Records. Album vyšlo už před nějakou dobou, já se vlastně se Stevenem domlouvám už pěkných pár měsíců a dnes jsem rád, že tedy Steven je tady s námi v našem koncertním studiu a bude hrát živě několik svých písní. A než se pustíme i do povídání, tak já poprosím o první píseň. Before we start the talking, I would like to ask you the first song. Sure, yeah. Uh, oh, uh, well, I thought I'd start off with um, a song from, from the first album. Uh, it's called Circling. Steven Johnston, nebo taky Damask Rose v našem koncertním studiu. A já možná začnu tím, že se právě zeptám, jak to tedy je s těmi jmény a názvy, protože Damask Rose je jednak to první album, jednak je to ta kapela, ale mám pocit, že i Steven vystupuje pod tímto jménem. 
So who's uh, Steven Johnston and who's Damask Rose actually? Because uh, I saw that Damask Rose uh, is the album, is mm. the band, I think, but it's also you. Yes, I guess. Uh, uh, I mean, not to give you my whole history, but it went through a lot of name changes and band changes. And I, th- I was doing a lot of videos and recording under another name, Ptarmigan Army. Um And then I, I met Pavel and Wojtek uh, Svatos as well, the top production team at Rustical Records, and with Martin. And um, yeah, it, it just evolved so beautifully. I don't know. It, it just felt like it needed a, a, a new separate name. Their contributions were were just so good, and uh, you know, in all in instrumentation and production ways that. Yeah, and I had that. I had an idea of of, of the name Damask Rose. Um, I, it, it's taken from uh, a, a track on Van Gelis's Blade Runner album, actually, the soundtrack. So I always thought that. Oh, I don't know if it is a a, g- a good name or a cool name, but I, I thought, oh right, I, I have a the opportunity to use that name as well. But it's, it's it just felt right that, along with you know the rhythm section as well, Tomash, Liska, and Stepan on drums. It just It needed a, a new name, so I guess it, it, I'm starting things off, but they they all make it the mask rose. Mm-hmm. Jak byla uh, tvoje dráha před the mask rose? What was your uh, music career before? Um, just a lot. Of, uh, I was in bands in Glasgow, um, but quite a while ago, uh, around yeah. 20 years ago and then again a lot of solo concerts here and there sort of sporadic and went off and did other other things you know other other jobs um maybe thought i would uh you know there was a, there was a time maybe of some years the guitar just sat in the corner and didn't get played so much but then yeah and I, i guess i did the sort of dramatic uh, left my job and left my uh flat where I was living, left everything and uh, came traveling and uh, I knew a, a lot of friends here in the Czech Republic and uh, it sort of, yeah, it all flowed so easily from here after meeting Pavel and, and Vojta. Mm-hmm. K tomu se určitě ještě dostaneme, ale já bych se zeptal na ten rozdíl, jaké to je hrát s kapelou a hrát solo, v čem je to jiné? When you play with band and when you play solo, what's the difference for you? Um, we haven't played too often together, but it is a, yeah, it's a big difference, obviously. And I, I, having played more, I guess, on my own, I've got to, I'm, le- I'm learning to leave a lot of uh, space for for other instruments I, i see a you know where i play i try and fill all the space um so that's yeah it's been a big learning curve for me to to play with other people uh, more and uh but yeah the songs change have changed and evolved as well um yeah just uh yeah different the song, songs going in different directions and different mm-hmm. uh ways and learning to leave a, a lot of sp- a bit more space. Takže přirozenější je to solové hraní. So more natural is the solo playing for you. Pardon me. Uh, more natural. Um, I guess that's what. Uh, yeah. Um, but I think it just added dimensions of a, a band. I've always been look, looking for for a band, I guess. And uh, well, I hope I finally mm-hmm. find one here, a very good one. But. Mm-hmm. Tak pojďme na další píseň. So the next song, please. Yeah, I thought I'd try one that will hopefully make it onto the the second album. Uh, this is called A Temporary Inconvenience. And I wrote it here in Brno as well. No one will make you happy How much is this true And how much do you need to believe No one will make it happen Better than you Say yes to this too Is it inconvenient That 
that everyone else is someone else instead You see, I'm so selfish I don't do exactly what you want me to do It's a temporary move, an exemplary groove We can only improve on the nail in the wall Cut my finger, but stop the picture for a pot of water boiling. It cooks and burns. Look and learn. The urns in the cemeteries holding the hopes of a hundred centuries. All the while yearning to set it free, to set it on free. One more care you can lose A passing wandering cloud across the sun A minor floor you're happy for when it's done It's the precious blemish sent to preempt Already moving It's already moving through. It's already moving through. Tak, takže to byla skladba z připravovaného druhého Alba projektu Damask Rose Stevena Johnsona a brněnských muzikantů, které si v tuto chvíli musíte přimyslet, ale na CD budou. Co si k Albu už teď můžeme říct? So that was a song from your forthcoming second, second album yes. with Damask Rose band. So what can we say about this album? What what can you say now? <laughs> well, yeah, um, I think it, I mean it's going to be There's not going to be any dramatic shifts in styles or anything, but maybe um, uh, the same but more. That's how I described it. Uh, oh, starting off again with um, my acoustic guitar, bass, and then yeah, the I guess the same the same production team and instrumental team. Hopefully, I don't know. My songs might have um, I don't know become a bit. Uh, a bit of a, a st taking a step forward in some way, or uh, I, th I hope so. Um, more forward thinking. Um, uh, it's hard to de describe, but yeah, I think uh, using a, a lot more harmonies as well. Um, yeah, the the same, the same style, but. More uh, deeper and, uh, I hope. I hope. Mm -hmm. Na začátku je tedy akustická kytara, co se potom v tom produkčním týmu s písněmi děje. So the acoustic guitar at the beginning and what uh, the production team uh, does with the songs. Uh, ah, the, yeah, the production magic. Uh, yeah, well, we just finished um, recording uh, my parts um, and then already in the studio, we, you know, Pavel has been playing a little bit of guitar, hearing and um, bass as well. Vojta, uh, he will uh, write the strings. We're going to have some uh, yeah, strings again, I hope, uh, with uh, Jakub and uh, Borjek, the uh, uh, sort of string team as well. And yeah, I think we'll send it to the rhythm section, see how they, they which sort of direction they take it down and then Pavel and Vojta I think uh, they can uh, sort of sink in with their parts hopefully the little their trademark 
hooks and things. Uh, I think I remember the, the first song I played, Circling, they they provided a nice uh, sort of backing harmony that any time any time we played together, that everyone seems to sing that <laughs> uh, as 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 well. So yeah, they were they're just like, oh yeah, a great bunch of talented guys who are always add so much to the my initial track. Mm-hmm. Funguje to většinou tak, že ten producent nebo producenti píseň nějak posouvají, ale mě by zajímalo, jestli e, autor má nad těmi písněmi nějakou supervizi, může si říct, co ještě dovolí a co ne. Uh, so there's this producer's work, but do you have some kind of supervision as the author and do you, uh, do you say uh, what they uh, allow, what you allow them to uh, do with songs and Well, no, I think they they just came up with uh, such good ideas, and they just we're just on the same, just feeling the same wavelength. I've got just full confidence in them that they're gonna come up with little, yeah, little riffs and uh, motifs, and uh, yeah, maybe maybe once or twice. I mean, remember on the first album there were maybe one or two things that didn't quite go for just just a different. They took it in a different direction. Maybe even I remember on just how one song, the note on which it ended, just took it and to a different sort of emotional feeling. But apart from that, there, there's. I mean, especially the strings, uh, their ideas for that really transformed a couple of songs on the first album. So yeah, but we'll be be back and forth um, communicating, and I hope to be back um, again for for the recording of the strings and and uh, and drums and maybe some hopefully guest mm-hmm. guest vocalists as well this time um, I've been playing a few shows with Moonshy uh, so that's been great and I hope she's gonna uh, sing on one of one of the songs Uhum. Tak o tom třeba zase za chvilku. Teď poprosím o další píseň a zeptám se, jestli bude opět z připravovaného Alba. So the next song and uh, is it going to be also from the next album? Or? Yeah, I thought I'd tr- uh, try this one. It's called This Spirit and I wrote it again is in Brno um, last March, um, a year past March, when I just arrived again to do some work with Uh, the guys and unfortunately the 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 well the war in Ukraine had mm-hmm. uh just started out so I, d- I wrote it with that in mind um yeah so and I tried to we tried to l- earn a little bit of money for for the cause out there as well but this is called this spirit <laughs> same road those ones march on their will to be strong so fragile how to sleep when you know that those feet step under such weight hope against hate so exile love peace and empathy feeling so empty under the strain compassion's refrain struck so down But no matter how much they crush to dust or block out the sun, the spirit will overcome. It's the rhythm to follow where they're just a hollow, monotonous hum. The spirit will overcome. Ringing hands was never a plan, so take a new stance. How long will you sit there on there? This spirit needs you with it to deliver it, not disfigure it. Love, peace and empathy, all this insanity will not 
not outlast their burnality just can't take the contrast but no matter how much they turn to rust or clean that they've won this spirit will overcome it's tomorrow where there is sorrowful day that's long gone Spirit will overcome. The Spirit will overcome. Love, peace, and empathy. What's so funny about that? Cause no matter how much they turn to rust or claim that they've won. Where there is sorrowful day that's long gone, the spirit will overcome. No, no matter how much they crushed it, us to block out the sun, the spirit will overcome. It's the rhythm to follow, where they're just a hollow, monotonous sound. The spirit will overcome. Spirit will overcome the spirit. Steven Johnston ze Skotska nám hraje v koncertním studiu Proglasu. Hovoříme taky o jeho projektu s brněnskými hudebníky o skupině Damas Crows, která připravuje své druhé album. Zaznělo tady jméno písničkářky nebo zpěvačky Moonshine, se kterou byl Steven nedávno na krátkém turné. Mě by zajímalo, jakým způsobem vlastně tam fungovala nějaká hudební umělecká symbioza. So you were on tour with Moonshine. Yes, so yeah. Can you say something about your uh, artistic symbiosis or how oh. how did you find uh, some common uh, way of speaking? Well, we met uh, Moon Moonshine uh, like like me had, had produced her first album with Pavel and and Voita Rustical Records. So we met at uh, Uh, crossroads, I think, where, where we we met y yourself as well. So, and then only th this summer we we started being, uh, you know, s in more contact by email and just helping a bit with the uh, lyrics, and it just f seemed to flow very naturally. Um, the idea for uh, playing a few few concerts over here, um, and yeah, I think we're just, I don't know, we're. I think yeah, we're similar uh, artists. I think and similar um, on the, again on the same sort of wavelength. Uh, it's just been very natural process, and I don't know. Hopefully, we'll have a few songs together as duets uh, in the future. Um, and uh, as I said, uh, she'll hopefully uh, be singing on on the album as well. Um, Yeah, I think we're yeah, just just on the same same wavelength and everything just seems to to work easily, flow easily. Mm -hmm. a bit like Mm. A, a ještě, the mm, se ještě zeptám na tu podobnost, jestli podobnost v čem, třeba v tématech písní, v náladě. Uh, you said that uh, her songs are uh, certain way similar. So similar in what way? Mood or topics? I think, uh, yeah, I think so. Um, Yeah, the, the 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 atmospheres we mm -hmm. we create, um, even down to our, uh, the sort of one one or two words of a sort of phrasing that on on the song, which I m might play now, which I did, and I thought, oh, maybe she, it would sound very uh, nice in her 
her voice. And I realized on one of the songs in her album, she's done something very similar already. So just that the, uh, sort of introduction to a song, um, just uh, uh, many, many things like that that were just, yeah, similar and, uh, yeah, coming from the same sort of musical place mm-hmm. and... Uh, když se ještě vrátím k té spolupráci s brněnskými muzikanty, v čem, v čem je vlastně ta spolupráce inspirativní, zajímavá, proč se k ní vracet? A je kam back to the cooperation with musicians from Brno. Hmm. Uh, what's interesting about it for you? Why these musicians? Uh, what's special on it? Oh, well, that's a big, big question. Um, I think just uh, obviously very super talented and uh, great ideas. Uh, I just I th- just found I don't know a, a certain uh, real enthusiasm as well. Maybe I haven't found anywhere else. Just from the from the first time I met uh, Pavel, yeah, just uh, I feel that really a real uh, interest and enthusiasm. And really, that I feel they really want to. They take it on as their own sort of. Uh, it's not a. Like, it doesn't feel like it's a a job for them. It's their passion, and uh, I feel my songs are in just the best hands. I think, and they're. I, I know they're gonna. I don't know. Fight, fight. Take them in other directions, and and uh, I don't know. If if something. I don't. It's, if something works, it just works, it, and you try not to analyze it too much. As I've done too much in the past, but it, yeah, it just seems to flow. And, uh, uh-huh. Tak pojďme na další píse, next song, please. Have, uh, okay, so uh, after uh, yeah, me- mentioning Moonshy, I'd like to. This is the one I hope she's gonna um, contribute to uh, beautifully on the album. Uh, so I'd, I'd like to play this for her uh, and Robin. This is in your arms. <laughs> That we're separate from it You can't see why this is taking so long In the silence It's keeping you strong today The next proposition I may take it, honey Flying away from where I want to stay But to play it safe It's a fatal mistake, you know It's all coming through It's all coming Trying to play the game It don't stay the same So forget it I'll be safe there in your arms In your arms This far away land, pray the station man, the whistle in his hand will send me winging westward like some songbird singing. Nursery rhymes long lost to time. My biggest crime was lying that I never knew them. But I'm coming through that. I'm coming. I looked into the sun in the city. Baby, safe 
from home in your arms. If there's a sunbird swooping, if there's a flower blue. Pořadu, jak se vám líbí, nám dnes hraje Steven Johnston ze Skotska. Hledejte případně nahrávky pod názvem Damask Rose. To je ta kapela, o které se tady průběžně bavíme, ve které Stevena doprovázejí muzikanti především z Brna nebo vůbec z Česka. Mě by teď zajímalo, co je na začátku Stevenových Písní, jestli jsou to příběhy, obrazy, nálady. What's, the big, what's in the beginning of your songs as an inspiration? Uh, some stories, uh, pictures, moods? Um, yeah, I, on, uh, that one, even I was, I was playing it, I was, it's quite an old, older one, so I was trying to remember what I was uh-huh. thinking. That's more, so, yeah, I don't know, imagery and... Uh, I start off with the guitar at mm-hmm. first, normally, and um, yeah, and then if I find a little piece on the guitar, it, it, I don't know, I'll pick up uh, words and phrases or, I don't know, I things I'd like to write a song about, and oh, I, do, I guess it's the, the tricky question, what are your songs about, but... Uh, Um, yeah, that, that's just, uh, I guess, a theme of maybe this album is finding peace, uh, both inner and outer, and uh, over overcoming almost yourself, and uh, getting over, you know, m- making mistakes is, is fine, and uh, just learning from things, and uh, uh, yeah, that would be theme of the album I think if you had to to press me on it mm-hmm. but I guess that's always a tricky question what <laughs> I just almost rather not say too much you know yeah. Okay. A je pro tebe důležité, aby lidé rozuměli těm textům, nebo stačí spíše, že mají nějaký pocit z té hudby? Is it important for you that people understand the lyrics, or is some kind of uh, 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 mood enough for you? Oh no, I think I hope, yeah, that they would. I do put a lot of time and thought into them. Um, Yeah, I would hope they would find some something in them, or I- some inspiration, or uh, I don't know, help. Uh, even if in mm-hmm. the way that, that music's helped me, you know, certain albums that you would listen to endlessly. At, I don't know, different parts of your life, uh, maybe more difficult parts of your life, and things like that. It, I'd be uh, thrilled if that if I, if I could mean. A, s- a little bit of that, uh, you know, to someone else, uh, help them through their uh, <laughs> daily uh, trials and tribulations. But if not, then hopefully, um, try and make it 
catchy, sound catchy as well. Mm. <laughs> tak, um, máme čas ještě na dvě písně, tak já poprosím tu předposlední. So we have time for two more songs. So the first of them. Sure. I'll do one from uh, the first album. Uh, this is called Your Home, Your Hopes, Your History. Mm-hmm. It's hard to live on your own But you don't have to share your home With fear, worthlessness and doubt Usher out anyone who welcomes them in And yes, throw those curtains wide and see Breakfasting on six impossible things But keep an eye on that dreaded cat flap For the inexplicable wandering in. We are shown how to cope with this mystery Through our hopes, our hopes and our history I'm not the center of attention You are the center of mine And with this new world view locked in Shocking scenes and reports of moving forward or right But I'm sick of picking through signs I just want Musím říct, že tohle byla jedna z mých oblíbených z Alba Damask Rose, Steven Johnson, živě na proglasu. This was one of my favorite songs okay. from your first album. Mně už teď nezbývá, než Stevenovi poděkovat, že k nám přijel, že nám tady některé své písně zahrál, uvedl tak vlastně ještě nevydané druhé album, na ně já se budu těšit a budu se těšit taky na nějaké příští setkání třeba s písněmi právě z nového Alba projektu Damas Crows. So thank you for coming. Thank you for playing. Thanks so much for for having me here. Yeah, and uh, I'm looking forward to your next album and maybe to next interview. Yes, I would love to come back in. Yeah, mm-hmm. that'd be great. Tak v tuto chvíli se od mikrofonu loučí Milan Tesář. Děkuji za pomoc našemu technickému týmu, zvuk Roman Kabelka, kamery 
Tomáš Hlávka a Steven Johnson ještě jedna píseň. Does it all have 